Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 with yours truly Lord of the and Mad. Hi Lord of Flows is Harmage of Spiffening, level 22, boxes man and cutest like it does 13 and almost a corpse. And all around neutral guy. Uh, let's heal up just a little in hopes of uh, surviving better in the hole that I'm heading to. That, that, that's the description, isn't it? Hole that I'm heading to. And then I'll take the combat shotgun, because it does a lot of damage. It, uses, it has a lot of ammo. And it might help me get through this mess alive. Assuming, of course, I'm not facing just ants. Hello? Anyone here? Uh, I'm afraid so. But where are they? Who are they? And... What is the general disposition towards nice people like myself? Metro security terminal, very easy. There's a metro ticket floating over there, as you can see. Okay, let's check this out. Um, okay, I have four attempts. So, the options are. Holds food. Oh god damn it, that was the wrong thing to do. That removed the dot. And right. So holds Solar Sword, Sonic Goons, Storm, Gobra, Hours. Not ours. Sword, no. Uh, okay, so this kind of makes it difficult. I'll be back with you when I figure it out. Okay. Can I try again? No. That didn't work out as well. Oh, this would have given me access to that, which would probably not have <laughs> worked as well as I could have hoped, because it probably have targeted me. Because that's what those do. You unleash them from the hellish sleep, and then they turn on you. Always the same old story. You cannot trust those things. Let's take this new controller and then explore the desk. I don't want a metro ticket. Does it hold much value? That's an apparently empty locker. And here we have bottle gaps, which are good. And in the desk, bottle gaps and stuff. And the chair to sit on. Oh, more rats. I suppose this is a valid option then. Because they fight melee, I might as well fight melee as well. Because they're not much of a threat. Because, you know... I always fight melee in video games. Well, almost always. And as such, I have an advantage over AI that's programmed to fight melee. At least in games with simple melee systems such as this. And it's a good thing it doesn't stop me from walking through, despite the fact that it's out of order. Hmm. I wonder if we could stab a more thing. While being stealthy. As fuck. I also picked up some things I did not intend to, but that shouldn't really be a problem, because it doesn't seem like these enemies here really carry a lot of things I might want to loot. That's a skull. I would happily loot that and take it to my character's home in Megaton and hang it as a trophy, despite the fact that whoever died, that death in this example, 
didn't really die by my hand and as such having it as a trophy is kind of irrelevant so more of a souvenir right that's another plunger stealth 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 not much here open lawnmower oh why is there a lawnmower in a metro station? Deep underground. Did they have a place for sand then? Or something? Hmm. You hear them, don't you? So do I. They're probably ready for us. More ready than I'll ever be for them. Oh, uh, that's more accurate than I hoped for. Those are ghouls. That is not what I expected at all. Feral ones as well. Ah, at least they're not enough of a threat that I cannot sleep. That's because they're locked in on the other side. Probably. Leaf blower. Actually, that's that's a pretty expensive item. Might as well pick it up. What else? What do I want? Ah, oh, there's some actual access to something here, and this safe, which I cannot unlock unless I level up. When will I level up? I wonder. I want level up soon. Might have to return here then. What is this? Due to a class 7 system failure, all service engineers are required to report for duty. Failure to report will result in termination per clause 45.7a of the maintenance service union contract. Have a pleasant work day. Oh. Well, more can do that. Alright. All sorts of good stuff there. Now let's listen to the data. Notes. Oh. That's cool. Congratulations on your purchase of the tasty clean sanitizer. I saw that. Congratulations on receiving your new DCTA standard issue laser pistol. Please take a few minutes to go over the guidelines posted in the DCTA Employee Handbook section 28.1.1.p and reprinted below for your inconvenience. Section 28.1.1b Proper Laser Pistol Usage It should be noted that all DCTA properties should be handled with the utmost care and used only when necessary. Maintaining personal safety during a communist attack is a good example of proper usage of your standard issue laser pistol. However, rodent population control is an inappropriate use and subject to disciplinary, disciplinary action as noted in section 11.3.5.c. Section 28.1.1b.1 Maintaining safe conditions with the laser pistol Using this laser pistol in the DCTA metro facility can be beneficial in many ways, but the operator must observe his or her surroundings before deciding to fire. The subway utility pipes often serve as a conduit to transport highly flammable gases. Firing the laser pistol in the presence of a gas leak could cause an undesired explosion and or several severe personal injury. Operating the laser pistol within proper specifications, that's section 28.1.1.b.2. It is required that all DCTA employees keep the laser pistol pulse energy length and repetition rate within the specifications diagrammed in the laser pistol user's manual. Failure to do so could result in severe rep reprimands from the DCTA regulatory regul regulatory <laughs> committee, committee as well as serious personal injury. That sounds like fun. Yes. Can I repair my laser pistol? I can. Does it decrease the damage? But I suppose. Leak detected. Auto shut off. Engaged. 
But does this leak mean that I will be able to fire? I oh, yeah, I see the leak. So if I fire my laser pistol. That seemed to take care of business pretty well. Most of it anyway. Those schools seem to be for melee range as well. So, bring it. Oh, they're pretty strong, aren't they? Or are they? Not even sure. Anymore. They're pretty dead, aren't they? Yeah, that's true. That's very much true. I wish they had purified water for me. Oh, that's just something being exploded-ish. Right. This feral ghoul had some gold for me. I mean, bottle caps. A baseball ball. Uh, I'm not sure I wanted that. They seem to have picked it up anyway. No. Oh. Once again, the issue comes to the fact that I haven't leveled up yet. I will though, soon. Very soon. So... I hope there won't be any raiders on this side of the facility because... Mm, the facility is well enough uh, spread out that... Oh, Tenet Town Friendship Station, what? Exactly that. It's spread out well enough that I cannot be sure that each section shares the same threats as the last one. And in fact, I believe I can be sure that they do not. DCNR Outpost. Who are they? And do I want to talk to them? Or will they kill me on sight? I suppose it's time to investigate. There's also a hammer here. No sickles there. Um. Oh, hello. These two seem like enemies. Where are they? No. Oh, wait. Wrong key again. Hmm. Right, so that red roach is just standing around here. Where, where were they hurrying? They really did seem to be in a hurry. And I believe. Oh. Is that where they were either now that was meant to be? Or is it that way? It could be that way. Let's investigate. I should probably not be using a sword. But on the other hand, there is still the Tradroach about. But I don't know where it is. There are also things around that are not red roaches and who might team up on me if they saw me I'm gonna take a risk and investigate yeah you can fight me bring it I just don't want the other guy's attention yeah you're fine too where are you? There. Does this mean they took out the super mutant? It might. Yeah, it does. Hello. He had a nail board. That's cool. I guess. Hmm. 
but I still don't know who this faction is whose lair I am approaching. I'm also picking up all sorts of stupid items that I didn't really mean to. Because I'm apparently very picky about my loot. Though I will, at any given chance, explore any opportunities to find loot. And this is a lot of gas. If I shot a laser pistol here, I would burn myself into a crisp. Hmm, crisps. I could do some right now. Ah, what's here? A tartan of cigarettes. For a change, I did not pick up everything. So here we have another feral ghoul. Pack of six and a harmonica. And... I don't really see where I'm heading with this nonsense. I'm, is it even the right way for me to go in hopes of finding uh, whatever the radio station? Make it good in the ticket booth? Not by the looks of it. Might as well have stuck outside. I had the same view of the situation from there. Okay, so... Rad roaches? Wait, seriously? Are they trying to tell me that rad roaches can kill feral ghouls? Well, I suppose they did take out a... guard at uh, Vault 101, but... Huh. Still seems unlikely. Especially since on this side. Where does this go? Chevy Chain. That is apparently the way I'm meant to go. So I suppose I'll look around a little? Or not? Oh, I might return here later. I'll just go and see what waits for me outside. So, until then, thank you for watching, I'll see you next time.